So this will be the first of two videos that I can make and then I gotta go out and get stuff done. I'll make the rest of the videos tomorrow that I said in the upcoming videos thing. Um, the War on Christmas. Where does this come from? Protestantism. And atheism. Uh, it's, it's an anti-Catholic sentiment. Um, and when I mean anti-Catholic, I mean Catholic both with a big C and a little C. So it, it does wind up including us, Eastern Orthodox, too. Um, <clears throat> ever since the beginning of the Protestant Reformation with Martin Luther spreading on to Calvin and the King of England, Henry VIII, it was all about tearing things down, destroying the culture as it was, destroying crucifixes, destroying churches, destroying stained glass, destroying any statues. Uh, a war on culture. And it exists today, and Protestants who um, I was invited to a confirmation of a Protestant girl, and I, I'm not going to tell you any how I know her or my relation to her or anything, because it's not important. I gave a medal to the Virgin Mary. Don't all Christians believe in the Virgin Mary? Apparently not, because the Father got very angry at me and said, we're not Catholics. I said, it doesn't really matter, does it? And it's just very, very hostile. So, I mean, if you want to know where SJWs come from, it's Protestantism and atheism. Why do you think they came out of the atheist um, faction? Um, atheism will always breed this because it's at war with the, the, the common Christian culture. Um, and Protestantism is a, is a form of, it's in between atheism and Christianity because that's why it has to attach itself onto things like the gay issue, to creationism, which were never points of Christianity. Right. There's some people that say, well, I don't, people who are forms of traditionalist Catholics or maybe they're um, Orthodox and they say, well, I don't believe in evolution as such. And I'm like, that's fine, but <clears throat> you're still not a creationist. Creationism is a specific thing. And they, I mean, because they can't attach themselves to the Trinity or the Nicene Creed um, or tradition. They they don't believe in tradition. Um, neither do the atheists. An individual atheist can believe in tradition, but atheists as such, since they have no underpinning of, of religion, um, because atheism is not just a rejection of belief in God. I mean, the connotation of nowadays of atheist is a rejection of religion. Um, so this is where it comes from, and it may be the vocal, anti-theistic, um, bitchy SJW, um, atheists now, but it started with Protestantism. This is why we consider Protestants and atheists to be essentially the same thing. Atheists are Protestants. They came out of the Protestant Reformation. They came out of that horrid period of time known as the Enlightenment, which was no form of Enlightenment. Enlightenment is a ridiculous term when they're juxtaposing it with the Dark Ages, but it was actually a fall from the Renaissance. The Renaissance ended and the Enlightenment picked up. And, um, the Enlightenment was really a way to say, hey, look at um, Protestant England and France. They're doing so much better than Italy and Spain. All right, peace to you.